dear students in this session we will learn about pharmacokinetic models so in the pharmacokinetics there is an important concept known as the pharmacokinetic models and a most widely used model in pharmacokinetics is compartmental model and before understanding what is this compartmental model we should know what is a compartment so the compartment is a kinetically distinguishable pool of kinetically distinguishable pool of organs or tissues what does this mean kinetics means what do we understand kinetics is it is related to the rates and amounts of the drug that enter into various organs and tissues so whatever is the route of administration the drug first enters into the blood central compartment then from the blood it enters into various tissues how it enters into various tissues is all the tissues are supplied with blood vessels and hence along with the blood the drug is also transported to various organs and tissues and hence in the body various organs and tissues they receive the drug and they leave the drug that means drug is entering into each and every tissue so i represent it as a box a tissue the drug is entering and simultaneously leaving like that there are different tissues and organs in the body and hence what is meant by kinetically distinguishable pool of organs means suppose into certain tissues and organs of the body if the drug enters at a rate which is similar in all the tissues and leaves at a rate which is similar in all these uh, tissues they are said to be as one compartment that means when the rate of entry the rate of entry is designated as ka rate of entry and rate of leaving is designated as kel so normally ka refers to the rate of absorption that means when the drug is given outside the blood the drug has to enter into the blood circulation that entry rate of entry is now known as the ka similarly the drug from blood it should enter into certain tissue again the rate of entry is can be called as the ka and then so you have several tissues like this and suppose if the ka and kel that means rate of entry and rate of leaving of the drug from several tissues is similar then all these several tissues behave in the same manner and hence they are clubbed as one compartment so normally in the concept of compartment it is based upon that means the compartmentalization or otherwise the division of the body into different compartments is based upon the supply of drug through the blood to various organs and also how the drug is leaving various organs based on these two concepts certain organs are grouped as one compartment for example certain organs of the body like say for example kidney heart and uh, such other vital organs they are highly perfused with blood vessels and hence the drug enters into these organs almost instantaneously as it is entering into the general circulation and hence the general circulation along with vital organs like the heart and kidney they are grouped as one compartment 